Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel. This is Enigma and you're watching Enigma Inc. So let's do Gemini, 15 to 31st of uh, March. Let's see the messages for Geminians, Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus signs in Gemini. This is a general reading. So for more personals, you can always book a personal accurate reading from me on WhatsApp, Instagram or email. You can also book a spell which is 100% white for your highest good and does no harm to anyone, which is totally spiritual. Other cheaper remedies are also available <clears throat> based on your interest. So you can reach out to me for the remedies as well. And daily, monthly and yearly horoscopes are available on my Instagram. So do follow me on Instagram. And other offers are also opening on my Instagram. So stay in touch with me there. Last but not the least, do not forget to subscribe to my channel for more videos on your Gemini. <clears throat> oh wow. Okay, you're making your friendships strong. You're taking care of your loved ones. And I feel people around you are feeling happy and victorious around you in your uh, company i feel people want to be in your company <clears throat> there's a lot of love that you are getting from the people around i see your friendships are going to get stronger i see you attending events celebrations partying it's all gonna be in good mood okay someone from three months i feel like might come back to you as well for some of you i feel Okay, so Gemini, I feel like there is this person who is been talking, like who has not talked to you from a pretty long time, maybe three months. This is this was a friend of yours, and I feel like they have been stalking you from three months or five months, and now they want to reach out to you. Now, someone from the past is reaching out to you. It could be not love related uh, situation, but it could be someone who is. <clears throat> A friend from the past was a good friend but now became a foe like that but I do see a uh, communication is coming towards you and someone is actually feeling really jealous and wants to hurt you like this this person is not having good intentions uh, Capricorn energy I feel like they're also going through a lot of emotional turmoil and things changed between you guys and this is not making this person feel stable so they're trying to stabilize their emotions so they want to come towards you but they're quite angry I feel deep inside this person wants the old connection back I feel okay however this can turn into something hot and uh, cold or sweet and sour kind of a connection Aries, Sagittarius, Leo coming in or another air sign. Okay, I do see there's a new relationship being formed. It's also telling me that maybe your ex wants you back or they just cannot uh, stand their disgrace. That their ego got crushed under your feet and now this person wants some sort of a revenge. They know that they're guilty, they're wrong, but they still don't want to accept it. So I feel like this person's trying to come back and win you way over. But when this person comes, they will realize that you're with someone else or you're interested in someone else. And I feel like there's love happening here. There's emotions flowing between you and your person. New person I'm talking about, okay? This is a new option that's come into your life. Scorpio, Pisces, Cancer, Sagittarius, Gemini, Capricorn. <clears throat> that is like growing romance okay this is like starting somewhere it's going somewhere you guys are innocently falling in love without you know even thinking about the future past pres uh, you're just living in the present and you don't even want to know about each other's um uh, whereabouts or background or stuff like that you just you you guys are just falling with each other just with each other's bare souls that's it this love is innocent i feel like right now you guys are in that honeymoon phase i feel like this person's like sending you a lot of messages and loving you and sending you deep emotions and you, it's it's making you feel happy and loved and at the same time you're falling in love and take care of this don't fall for uh this too fast or too early <clears throat> this person is dreaming about you fantasizing about you even in 
uh, the daytime so they're doing all of this in with the eyes open they have a lot of emotions I feel this person crushing over your hearts this is like um, um, puppy love I <laughs> feel your, your person is feeling like that all right so Gemini I feel like right now you are making this person's life a little bit miserable because you're acting difficult or you're in, you're coming off as difficult to handle and I feel like this person's totally pure emotions whereas you're trying to control because of the past experience. Gemini you might be testing this person but I feel right now they're just too innocent. I feel like you're going to realize that and it's going to make you happy that this person's still doing so much for you you know. <clears throat> But later on, you'll get to know that this person who's acting like all puppy and all fallen in love, you will realize that this person has their own empire and you will be impressed by them. You know, this person is someone who's quite down to earth, doesn't show their um, background or luxuries and all. But they enjoy a lot of luxuries in life and they're the boss of their own life. They have their own empire as well, I feel. But this person's looking for a stable love romance, like commitment, because they didn't get that in past. So they see that in you and this could be an Aries or a Leo or a fire. There's a lot of fire in this person's energy and I feel they have a lot to give you. And this is fully masculine. Okay, this is someone who's quite masculine, like manly or if this is a female, then also they have a very giving nature. <clears throat> they do everything, you know, and they, they won't disappoint you. That kind of an energy. But I feel this person will bring a lot of order and stability in your life that you always wanted. And I also sense that this person feels or going to make you feel like excited. Like you will be on top of the, um, you know, bridge, I would say. I don't know if that makes sense. But you'll be like standing like in a Titanic pose and making you, you're going to make yourself feel all special because this person is always going to, you know, uh, put you on a pedestal. So that is why you're going to be super happy with their um, behavior because they know how to treat the person with respect. And you're so special for this person. Uh, right now, they might be <clears throat> checking on your social media, trying to get more knowledge about you as a person and what you do, uh, you know, in... Uh, during the day during the night because they're quite interested in you and i feel like the, some sort of obsession is still there like a slight um, taste of obsession is there pinch of obsession is still there but i feel like this person is actually um very interested in your social media like they're watching your pictures like even your past pictures they're watching and they're getting very happy and excited and that is why so much of innocence in their love um we also feel that you have a lot going on in your life and you're always on uh, you know on the go here or there or you're always doing more than one thing at a time and you're too busy in your life that's what they also feel and this is making them a little stressed out because they want your time they want your attention somewhere you're taking it for granted okay they will make a move towards you, but they're waiting for the right time. But I feel like this person is getting anxious because also they're scared of losing you or being too late to approach you. Okay. <clears throat> oh my gosh, Gemini, why are you behaving so rude with this person? I feel like you're the one who's behaving rude with them. You might say some cruel words uh, that might that might make this person feel like a failure or betray their uh, trust or ego and not trust i feel like that may hurt their ego really badly i feel like this person may go into mental stress or depression so be careful about your words okay don't get too sharp because you're always straightforward like on the face but somewhere i feel like you might mis misunderstand this person and say some rude words so Give them some space and time to express themselves because they're not someone who express openly. They're like very calm, composed, serious type of person. Doesn't talk much, male or female. I feel like you might get suspicious of them initially. So this might hurt them or push them back also. But then eventually you'll fall in love. You'll realize that this person is the one that dissolves you and nobody else. Because you guys are like king and queen of your tinsel town okay so with the sun here i see marriage happening between you guys definitely this is the person that you're going to get married to if they haven't reached your life wait for three more months okay for some it could be like 
it has already happened for some it could be a little late okay this could be a Virgo Taurus Capricorn as well I see like you're like balancing of feminine and masculine this another card that is confirming marriage here so I do see you guys maybe going towards I also see like you guys are sitting on a throne like all of you and this tells me that you guys are going to be you know a power couple like people will see you like king and queen of the castle you know like that so um, very bossy in your own way and they, uh, they are in their own way <clears throat> you guys are um, you know um, holding your positions very you know diligently like you have, you have highly dignified personalities that's how you will be when you guys are together and then there's I feel like life becomes more fast and you guys are going to touch the sky when you guys are going when you guys are together you guys, you guys can manifest anything so this is like a new beginning there's a massive new beginning so many major arcanas which tells me that you guys are meant for each other twin flames not twin flame i wouldn't say that like it's a higher level soulmate like a totally spiritual and boss connection power couple power pact you guys together can change this world. You guys together can make things happen that you never expected yourself or others. You've you've never seen others do what you guys together would do. <clears throat> like you guys will be like millionaire, I feel. Together you guys are going to form the biggest empire uh, in your locality or something like that. I feel. So this is the person that's coming for you. So don't just end up ruining things by saying some stupid words. Um, somewhere I feel maybe Gemini you might become snobbish take care of that six of pentacles telling me like this person's coming up with some sort of a helping hand I feel like this person has a power to help financially as well as even they have a lot of wisdom and guidance that you might be looking elsewhere this person has it so they're going to be always very noble and chivalrous towards you and even others they are very passionate about helping people could be a libra uh, energy but they always want trust they always want honesty in the connection so they expect that from you this is a soulmate definitely <clears throat> yeah this person is going to propose you for marriage oh my gosh ten of cups what else do you want i feel like this uh, connection might go through some uh, burdens okay and especially from your end but i feel like this person will stay consistent in getting you in their life and being your life partner so i do see you guys will end up with each other power couple yes strongly all right what else do we have it's safe this person's totally safe and that is what angels are telling you so just chill okay don't be in this energy relax let go of control issues. So you are trying to control the situation by backing this person off or pushing this person away, expecting them to be flirtatious. I feel like flirting is a kind of the, uh, showing their interest towards you. So don't take it like literally like they are a flirt or something like that. Gemini. What else we have here? co-create see you guys are going to create big massive changes together and i feel like you guys are going to build an empire together especially in your 40s all right so this is a very 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 powerful read i would say it's like fully power packed do subscribe and like this video to ensure that you're enjoying this and do comment down below and let me know how this is how is this making you go, go, go crazy about unlikely what is unlikely tell me this is impossible kind of a situation right i feel like this situation may also go in a negative direction because you may not trust that this, something like this can happen with you okay so somewhere for some people it might not manifest because you're not in a positive headspace so it only depends upon if you believe into it if you believe in this funda Okay, because God is giving you this opportunity, then only you can avail because God is giving you this opportunity through angel messages. So go through those messages. I see a lot of 333, which is a number of manifestation. So yeah, I do see that coming in. Gemini, crown chakra, use your brains because 
I do see you might do something unusual from your uh, knowledge and you're gonna you know that have that will have a massive impact on the people around you so and also be careful about your words yeah that is a strong message I'm getting for you guys in this month courage I feel like you're going to be very strong and you're going to be very powerful in communication like communicating your mind and I feel like you'll communicate whatever you feel you should um, communicate with a lot of confidence and courage so you're you will be heard whatever you say the number of miracle I feel like miracle is happening in your life and I also sense that for some of you, you might be like, it's too good to be true. But then these things do happen if you believe in it, right? You need to release the thought of, I'm not good enough. That's what I'm sensing. Or if this is a past person that you're still holding on to, fuck that. Gemini. Door to spirit, you're moving in towards spirituality i see a lot of spiritual things happening one after the other in your life confirming that angels are around you and that you've started awakening yourself spiritually so let's end this reading from with the all sign how does your person feel about you from aries to pisces let's see gemini how does the aries person feel about my Germanians? By the way, I enjoy this reading so much, literally. Aries is like feeling heartbroken. I feel like they think you don't like them and you don't want to, you know, date them and that they're not good enough for you. Right now, they're feeling sad. The Taurus is confused. They don't know what you want. Gemini is already thinking about marriage with you. Cancer is right now. I feel like there's something that they're hiding from you, but they do like you. But I feel like this person is in, in their own world and they might not be telling you exactly what is going on in their mind. They also themselves are confused, so slightly on the moodier or emotional side. Leo is having options, so they might be looking at someone else as well and making a decision like in crossroads. Virgo person is coming towards you. I feel like they have been thinking about you a lot. And Libra is coming towards you with communication. Like they are major attraction they have for you. Uh, Scorpio is quite confident that you will be theirs. Sagittarius is obsessing over you. And I feel this is more on the last side. Capricorn is coming in with an offer. I feel like this person may bring a proposal as well. Aquarius is too stressed. I feel like they are going through some anxiety and um no sleep pisces wanting to strengthen this connection could be a karmic but doesn't matter but i feel like this pisces feels a strong pull towards you and i feel like spices getting affected by you like influence getting under your influence in a positive way that is about it gemini i hope this reading helped you and do not forget to like share subscribe and hit the bell and tell me how this resonated till then take care of yourself and do follow me on instagram bye